Hi there, George Cook with Spade TV. Today's episode centers on how to manage all this running line. I mean, look at all this, just a big old wad here. There's a lot going on. I need a way to manage it. I need some methodology. Today we're gonna to talk about two ways to do this. One, the 50% rule which surrounds counting and the use of the handling line on a Rio Connect core shooting line, which is one of the greatest tools ever brought to the table in shooting running line technology and usage, okay? So, you can see me here with all of this. So let's go ahead and make a cast. We'll make a good old snap tee with Mr. Wiggles, the 7126 Excel. Mr. Wiggles hucks it out there. I mend, I swing, I'm about to be in the goodie box. Nobody wanted to play. We're gonna let her soak a little bit though, just cause. Now we gotta strip in. It's time for next cast. So, I could just kinda go about wild stripping and strip and strip and strip. Keep stripping. And I could eyeball things and go, well, there's my head. Uh, how about there? I could do it that way. A couple of problems with it. I don't know if you can see here, but between my reel and about probably four to five feet from my rod tip, this line goes all the way down there. That's roughly 16 feet away. That's a lot of water drag on that line. Now, if I go to cast now, I make that snap tee, and I cast, chances are pretty good all that running line will not shoot, of which it didn't. Too much water drag. Could not defeat water drag with that cast. So I gotta come up with a better method. I cannot have all that line dragging downstream that becomes a fight, a fight to cast, a fight to shoot the line. I don't want that. I wanna be fight free and launch. That's what I want. So I'm gonna use the count. Somewhere between my hand and the ideal touch point to make my cast is a count, is a count. And I'm gonna guess that there's about 10 strips there. Okay, we're gonna go with 10, we're gonna see if we're right. If there's 10, 10 divided by two is five. So on strip number five, I'm gonna coil. In other words, I'm gonna put the 50% rule in effect. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five. Five is half of 10. Even a wazoo kid can figure that out. There's five coiled. There's six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Guess what? Perfect. Now I'm ready to cast. And you'll notice that the water drag factor here has been cut by 40 to 50 percent. A good solid 40. I go to make that same snap T, Mr. Wiggles. Nice big clean cast. The cast was greatly helped by the reduction in drag brought forth by the use of the 50% rule in terms of my strip. Now, I've used that method for years versus just trying to look and gauge. Now, Rio brought out some wonderful shooting lines, connect core shooting lines low stretch technology, get connected. They brought out this line called a grip shooter. Distance with control. Fabulous shooting lines. Even greater is the control element that both of these set up with a bright orange handling line. So we know there's a 10 count here, 
but we also know there's a color identification. So I'm gonna use, I'm gonna use the count and we'll see where we end up. One, two, three, four, five. There's my coil spot. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now, there is approximately, if we measure that on the rod, there is about 15 feet, maybe 14 and change of this bright orange handling line. Once I make that strip where that orange enters my hand, generally somewhere between the striking point to even one more strip, we are automatically in place with the great overhang or the level ahead that's overhanging the running line off the tip to the head, which creates the overhang, we're spot on. So here's a little snap Z cast. Came off the water efficiently. I had the right hold. Overhang was dead on. Straight as an arrow cast with lots of line speed. Mr. Wiggles at work. Now, I've still, I can identify the color. I can identify the color as it comes into my hands. My count though still matters. Why? Because I want to cut the amount of that line in the drag. I'm only going to coil once. I'm going to coil at 50% because unless you came from a rock climbing background, and you can layer different coils in your hand, don't do it. I'm telling you, don't do it because the goat rope is coming your way. It just will not fly. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. There's my color check off. I had a 10 count. I cut it five. Money. Snap Z. Fire. Men. Let's go get in a goodie box. See if somebody's home.